What's up you guys, welcome back to another video, it's your boy Cinder Squirrels here, and in today's video guys, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make an AFK pumpkin setup. So, um, first of all, what you will need is, depending, um, per each row, you will need, um, two sprinklers, and as well, you, um, you will need four pumpkin seeds. So, that's basically what this is all based off of pumpkins I'm at AFK farming pumpkins not seeds because seeds there's already a video on that and I don't need to review that this is more of I'm I'm looking more to like find out how to AFK um farm pumpkins because I personally just really like how pumpkins look they are actually like one of the best building blocks in my opinion as if right now they're just really underrated so today I'm going to be making a video on how to do that you will need a bunch of grass, a bunch of conveyors too. And also, guys, um, something else is this. Like, you don't need the pumpkin seeds. I do need um, my plow. And my sprinklers. I feel like no one uses the search thing anymore, but that's fine. Anyways, guys, um, without further ado, let's just get right into the video. So, I have an area over here where I'm going to build it. It's a pretty spacious area. Pumpkins are just an amazing block, so. And also, guys, right now, you could make a decent profit off of selling pumpkins, because some people do actually want pumpkins. Not everyone, but there are people out there that will buy pumpkins. That looks bad, sorry, I just need to fix that, yeah. But then, look. So, I'm going to go out one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12. Yes, 12. And, um, one of the first things that I'm going to mention is that right here I'm going to have a right conveyor belt. And, so, no, okay. So, one thing that I will keep, one thing to actually keep in mind is that this setup will require a lot of conveyors, so it will be a bit expensive. Conveyors are, right now are going for like 10k, I think, I'm not sure. Because I actually don't buy conveyors, so like, I don't focus on the price for them. They're just not my thing. I do not, I've never actually bought a conveyor. Ever. I've always grinded them out, so. Um, yeah. Um. So, what you're gonna do is you're going to like, just... Um, fill this all up with conveyors, and, um, I'm, I think that this is a bit too much, but, like, it's okay. Um, here we go, we have enough right here. Two, three, four, five, six, yes, six. And then, I'll leave, actually no, yeah, I need this extra block right here. I do need that, okay. So, right here guys, what you will need to do is add your right conveyors, and actually, matter of fact, I think that I could just do it like this, and shorten this one block. Yeah, yeah, that's possible. I can actually shorten that one block. That's amazing. That just, I didn't actually think about that. Okay, that's great, actually. So right here, you'll need another right turn in conveyor. Right there, placed like so. And then, what I'm going to do right here is that I'm going, I'm going to have one, two, and one right there. And also, since I'm doing this to the left, one, two, and one as well. Now my, all of these will go right there like so. All of the sprinklers. And then, of course, I just think that there should be a grass block right there for now. For that side. Next. Um, I'm not trying to like get, um to fall off the void, fall off into the void. I'm not trying to make that happen, so I'm not gonna do that. Boop, boop, boop. 
Okay, yeah, I'm good now. Then now, now you'll need your left ones. You'll need your left ones now. This time going this way. I'm going to place my blocks again. Once again, I'll have my blocks, my epic blocks. Yes, blocks. Amazing blocks. My, my default grass blocks here. I'm not using anything too fancy. And also, I do need grass blocks in general. Because you can't plant anything on, like, anything else, so. Well, now, now, once again, here, oh yeah, I need to add those. And then, right here, I need to plant this. No, I need to plant this right there, yes. And then, I'll just add a thing right there, like so. And then I'll add another left conveyor belt going that way. And this process is just pretty repetitive, so um, I'm just going to like pause the video, and I will be back with you guys once I finish up this process. Okay guys, so I'm finally so close to the end, sorry I'm lagging a little bit. Um, last conveyor that I have to place. I'm honestly like really excited. It took me so long, it took me like 10 minutes to do this. So, 10 minutes might not be long to but for me, building something like this, taking 10 minutes take, is like just really annoying. It's literally night time now. I have not been doing the plowing or anything at all. Just been doing this. So, as you can see right here are the last amount of conveyors that I'll need. It will be a right conveyor right here. Boop. And poof. Now, you see all these holes? You will want to fill them all up. And on, like, that row on the hole, like, right now, I'm facing to the right, on the, I'm on the right side. But the whole lane that's on the left, you do not want to do that one. And you will see why soon now that I did this guys this is where the next part comes in if you really wanted to you could be careful and go another extra an extra way out here which I kind of do want to do but as if um, that would just be a little like adjustment you guys can do on your own time when you guys would like then what you guys would do or like right now while you guys are building this you guys can just do that on your own but then this right here is just the way back home I guess you could say because this is all just a setup that you're trying to get all the way back home and go into a circle this is just a complicated circle I guess you could say complicated loop like you know how on Discord you're like you go on music and you're like a do like um in your own Discord server and you want to listen to music you're like a loop like it's everyday bro or something I don't know just anything yeah it's it's like that then doing this exact same pattern you're going to keep the exact same pattern going for this whole thing no matter what you do. This pattern is the pattern that you'll need. This pattern is one of the biggest keys on making this work. You guys, and also I will mention this guys. That it is not actually like mandatory to have the sprinklers. It is not actually mandatory to have sprinklers. And by the way guys, you see this back row right here? if you're doing it to the right and like you want to be facing this way then you put one right here but if you're not you will you put one over there on that side but I did it on the other side because I'm a lefty guy I like left side things I'm more of a left guy I just feel more comfortable with the right with the left I mean I don't know what it is but I do okay So, now, after you do this, what you guys are going to want to do is 
since I have all my sprinklers down, you're going to want to over every single sprinkler, you're going to want to go up one block, like so, and build simply just a um just build that and i'll be back once i have this part done as well okay guys i officially did this part and so now what you guys are as you guys i'm not sure if you guys know this but all of them do not have water right now so what you are going to do now is add simply the water catchers on top of here like so and i'm pretty sure that it will still reach the sprinklers I think it will. So, um, I'm going to pause this part out right here, or cut it, and see if it actually does work. Hopefully it does. Because, um, yes it does. Oh, okay. Yep, the sprinklers are working. I can see that right now. Now, of course, guys, the last part, of course, is placing the pumpkin seed. Because, of course, yeah, you need pumpkin seeds. As I said before, per each row, it is four pumpkin seeds per row. And then next, I'll explain to you guys what um, happens next. So, I, I'm not going to pause me placing down the seed because, I don't know, it's not really a boring part to watch. It's just kind of satisfying to watch, in my opinion. There we go. Do that. Do this. Do that. I'm. I personally did forget about that block right there. Him. You may end up forgetting about some blocks, so if you do, don't worry. You could just delete them afterwards, or like forgot that you placed a block and you didn't delete it. Them yeah. right here. And. I did do 10 rows, so I know that I'm missing a pumpkin seed somewhere. Yes, right here. Okay. And so, as you guys can see, the water actually does help make them grow a little bit faster. As you can see right here, they're all growing a little bit faster. And so, this is basically the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys are questioning how exactly it is, that you AFK farm it, right? I'm going to do a little quick preview on that. I'm not going to, like, actually take... It's going to take a while to go through all of these, so... It'll take, like, a few two minutes just to go through all of it. Yeah, I know it's long, but, yeah. you All you, all you will need to do is have a pumpkin seed out, right? Conveyors do not move you very fast, either. And you'll have, like... You'll have to be clicking, like, right here... A harvest will pop up, and when you click on the harvest, it will also have to be, like, on top of the seed. And you will have to do that so that you can also harvest the, um, the pumpkin seed while replanting. Um, I would say 10 millisecond, um, cooldown on it, or maybe even 40, um... Here, let me just test this real quick. Yep, I say 40. 40 milliseconds is good. M my auto clicker, um, in my, I'll definitely have that linked. Even though you guys probably do know my auto clicker by now. So, anyways, besides that, I'm to you fools. Thank you for watching. This app will, um, if it's two minutes to go through this, right? Pumpkins take about, like, four minutes, I'm pretty sure. Then you will get about, um, Depending how much rows you have, if you have double this amount of rows, which is 80 pumpkin seeds, yeah, 80 pumpkin seeds, if you make it, like, um, a full eight rows or whatever, right, you will get about, um, let me just do the math, 80, 80 every four minutes, right, and multiply that by 10. Yeah, you'll get about, you you guys will get about 400 and, you guys will actually get about 
400 and something, 420 or 480 pumpkins per hour. So this is a pretty OP setup. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please remember to subscribe if you're new. I'm Seafoles. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace out and goodbye, my people.